How's it going everyone? Travis 95 HD. This is the Run Division 1. And currently it is a Saturday. And a good PPL team in the background. But on Saturdays, I want to talk about this real quick. I always like to relax and um uh, I have bowling on Saturday mornings. Uh, right now it's international break, so there's not gonna be much footballing going on in the uh, US and you can't really do much about that but I always like to relax sit down play some FIFA maybe I have to do a little homework here and there but I, I I like the weekends when it comes up and I you know try to take advantage of it and do everything that I can to uh, enjoy it I played basketball last night got a good a uh, little bit of a workout and a good start to the weekend so far but back to the video this guy had a good BPL team and no doubts about it he was not a bad player at all and he scored first with Balotelli, a bit unlucky for me, but he got a goal and he's going to take it. It was striked back with Honda, and then right in the 44th minute, Juan Mata on his left foot absolutely hits one top corner, 45th minute. Can't take anything away from that. At the moment when I was playing, I'm like, oh my god, Juan Mata cannot finish that well, but... Nonetheless, he got a good goal. In this game, I seem to counter very quickly off of goal kicks and get lucky sometimes, but I counter nonetheless off of goal kicks a lot, it seems to be, with this squad. Mark Gonzalez showing off his pace, whips one in. Lucky diving header with Dumbia, and at this point, I am getting pumped. I'm getting back into it. 2-2 two -two against a better BPL team, and it seems like I have put the pressure onto him, and that's definitely indeed what happens. Lovely build-up play, and I think that was a shot from Dumbia, but Eto's on hand, tap it in. And he throws a fist pump in there, not fist pump. Uh, whatever you want to call it, uppercut, something of that nature. Showing that we're ready to go, we're ready to get 3-2, keep the lead, get one more possibly. Dumbia set and free, and he is going to finish that. No ifs, ands, or buts. Four-star weak foot. Dumbia is absolutely this goal scorer of this team. And justifiably so, he gets on the score sheet every game. So, nothing to complain about with him. A good bargain buy, if I must say so myself. 10k coins for a good striker is definitely cheap of a bargain so far. In 85th minute, Dumbia shown once again his weak foot finishing ability. And says, get up guys, let's go. 5-2, that's the way it should finish. And that is indeed the way it does finish. A 5-2 win for the club. Staying good on the attack, um, conceding a couple goals, but one of them was an amazing strike, one unlucky. What are you going to do? You're just going to take the result and move forward and hope that you do better. So we're sitting good in the division, actually. You see that we did do pretty well, 2-0. and And for Division 1, that's not too shabby, if I must say so myself. I show a little bit of trading right here because I always, with the road to run to Division 1, I end up playing um, a lot of games, but if you if you have so much footage, there's only a certain amount of things you can do without interfering with the run to Division 1. So what I always like to do is do a little bit of trading. And uh, right here, I just show you actually the way I go about trading. You see I have a bunch of Crescitos and um, a couple of Morales, Boateng, and Richardsons, but mostly Crescitos. I like to pick one of the best, if not um, like... I'll give you one example. James, or Burt96HG, his name's James. He did uh, this with Jao Pereira, won the second best right back in the league besides Danny Alves. And if he's the second best, second best, second best in the league, he's going to cost a bit more. And Crescito is the best in the Russian league for the left back position. It's him and Ansaldi. So if you have the second best or the first best, they're always going to be in high demand and high price. So if you pick one of the high demand players, you and if you can pick them up for a thousand coins under, you're always gonna have the market to to, to be able to sell them because someone's gonna want them if they're building that certain league team, and they're always gonna need that player. So that's what I did with um the Crescitos right there, and they do eventually sell on for at least like a thousand coin profit on every single one of them. This guy has got an amazing Bundesliga Serie A slash hybrid team, and he has Robin, Infram, Royce, Gomez, Schneider, just a really really good team. And he actually gets it started with a bit of a defensive error from me. And then he does the dick celebration like everyone does. And I can't say there was a bad goal. 
Uh, I just got a little bit unlucky, not clearing it out right away, but he does definitely take advantage with a lovely strike on Iron's Robin, Iron Robin's beautiful left foot. But we would fight back with Mark Gonzalez throwing a little bit of a new animation, I would think, in the finishing ability he does with his left foot right there to rifle it past the keeper and throw it into the back of the net. I thought I'd re-show it because it was more like a toe poke, outside foot finesse shot. Whatever it was, it did indeed look good. And right here, Marco, Roy Marco Royce getting sent through, and uh, there's a celebration. He got lucky, I would say, in my opinion, to get the goal even. Um, but what you going to do? <laughs> Celebrations, that was, oh, man. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Those pat piss me off so much when you do a celebration like that. But you have to try to get back on the horse, try to get another goal. And that's what this squad has come to do is get back in the game and get a goal pretty much. Denisov playing it up to Dumbia who finishes it on his left foot again. Getting a lot of le left foot goals for the club. Even though that is not his preferred foot. And uh, we decide to uh, milk the celebration for all it's worth and try to play it out. And in the 75th minute I'm feeling like I can mount a comeback. Maybe score another goal. But it was not to be. The game ended in a 2-2 draw. Uh, disappointed not to get the win, but what are you going to do? And that's it for me, Travis95HD, and as always, I'll see you next time.